Hi everyone. Hello. Hello. Welcome to our Lux movie review. So today we will be doing our group discussion, uh, the fourth group discussion. Yeah, yeah. fourth. So how is everyone doing? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So far so good. Nice. Shall we start? Yeah. Yes. yes. Sure. So time. You can we start with your name, matrix number, your yeah. favorite color, favorite. and the reason why. Yeah, why? Okay. Alright, so first of all, um, hello, my name is Tan Ken Ho, and my metro number is 196267. And my favorite color is black because I love black and just like simple. 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 And just. It's like mysterious. Mysterious. Represents nothing, is it? <laughs> simple is nothing. Nothing is simple. Just like. Wow, nice one. Okay, thanks. Okay, hello, good, even, good evening everyone. I'm Wong Jinke with the matrix number 196604. Mm, my favorite color is blue color because blue color symbolizes calm and peace. So I like this color. And my wardrobe is full of blue color skirts. Dress. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I'm boring with that already. <laughs> you can go shopping. Okay, yeah. 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 Sure. Uh, okay, hi, my name is Amira Farzana. My matrix number is 196062 uh, and my favorite color is probably pink because, you know, it's just feminity. Mm. Okay. okay. Okay, so hi, my name is Nisa Hadira, Mithin Arazal. My matrix number is 197562 and my favorite color would be, I'm not sure but mostly, <laughs> most of my wardrobe is white, so I would say white. White. Because white presents uh, pure and it's like you're so innocent and kind and all this stuff but I don't know why I like to wear it so I'm not really innocent and kind but sure <laughs> <laughs> okay, Hi my name is Mama Ibrahim Bismadi my text number 198352 my favorite color is uh, yellow because it's to me it's be um, cheerful for cheerful. me uh, okay Okay, my name is Titangara and my matrix number is 196802. My favorite color is green. So green is like symbolize environment to wow. for the nature. So, so you like nature? Yeah. Ta da! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, my name is Mama Ishamuddin Abdul Kari and uh, matrix number is uh, 198198. And yeah. my favorite color is blue. Because blue is like a cloud, so it's really my okay, essential. It's relaxing. Mm. Okay. My name is Ahmad Faiz Bermudan. My metric number one nine six two zero eight. Uh, my favorite color is red because angry. Uh, <laughs> angry. Like extreme. Like extreme. Okay. Extreme. Okay. Red also sometimes represents passion sure. and strength. Yeah. Patient. So do you have passion and strength? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> it's good to know. So, um, in our last meeting, we watched uh, Life of Pi. Yeah. And yeah. it was a great movie. We yeah. It's really great. Too much and of the lessons. graphics. Yeah. 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 And the uh, graphics were very nice. And the green all the yeah. and agree, yes. disagree. So, anyone would like to start first? How about you start first? Mm -hmm. <laughs> what do you think? Alright, I can start first. <laughs> so, um, what we've watched, like, what I love about the movie is that the storyline is very unique because other storylines are just like, okay, maybe the boyfriend girlfriend meet up, uh, fight, 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 <coughs> climax, someone uh, dies yeah. or something, someone gets shot, someone will like uh, sacrifice himself. Uh -huh. But yeah, it's so cliche, right? Exactly, it's the word. But in Life of Pi, it's something different. Like, it's nothing like any other movie I've ever seen. Because who gets stuck on an island in the middle of nowhere for 227 days with a freaking tiger named Richard Parker? Yep. You know, it's like, it shows survival and strength and motivation for how much you live. Because we know that sometimes humans, ourselves, we lack of motivation to keep moving on even in our daily lives. But to see someone, they want to move on with their life and how he struggled on the island how he made a boat by himself, how he handled Richard Parker and how he didn't eat Richard Parker for his meals. So I can see that it really represents motivation. Wow. Yeah. wow. Tita? Uh, for, me, review. for me, it, okay, for me it's about life of a shows religious lesson. Religious, religious lesson. Yeah. 
the main character name is Spy, who is well, oh, is a Hindu guy, yeah. and learn about other religions also. He respect Christian and Islam. So it's like we need to love other religion also. Something like we need to love in our Malaysia to avoid racism. So it's important in Malaysia because we really emphasize on yeah. unity. And even though we all here are from maybe Hindu or Buddhist or Muslim, like we all respect each other's religion and yeah. we put that aside and unite together to accomplish something. Yeah. Yeah. And he is also born in a family which his father is believe in science and he, and his brother also, but his mother is believe in Hindu. Or, Oh, uh, believe in God. Uh, strong in yeah. strong in religion. Strong in, mm. Yeah, <coughs> so he still can balance both sides. So always be there will uh, be a con conflict. Yeah, but at least he can still still have a religion. At least at last, after his two hundred and seventy seven days of um, uh, what uh, life on the ocean. <laughs> Nothing. Yeah. yeah, for me, Life of Pi is just a great, just interesting story for me. And one of the things that I think just for me is just like interesting. Uh, so, uh, Pi is follow so many religions, and he believes that God is one of the important things we need to pursue in our life. Right? And another thing is, he he survived two hundred and seventy-seven days. And this is a miracle. It's a miracle. It's a miracle. It's a miracle. Yes. A miracle. It takes a lot of skill. Yeah. Yes. yes. And for me, for our side, he surviving such a so many days. I think it's not impossible. Uh, and you think it's impossible surviving a boat? And middle of the ocean with all the circumstances all the yeah. circumstances limited resources yeah for me i think i would die <laughs> you would die <laughs> lack to lack of the what to survive you need to have some knowledge to survive yeah, yeah. yeah. Yes. survival skills survival have you guys skills. ever watched men vs wild on discovery channel yeah, awesome. men vs wild i live at some drag reels amira okay uh, what I think about life of Pi is it's the survival of, uh, of them uh, are really great for me, and I think there's uh, they have synergism together. They can live together, although they are not in the same species of uh, of organism. But then they can live together without having any trouble. So it fascinates me actually. So, you guys have anything to say, Kimi? What do you think of the movie? For me, the movie is uh, really good uh, with the graphic, you know, to edit the tiger. To edit tiger, yes. On yeah, the tiger. Tour, you watch 3D high. or the normal version? The normal version. Oh. So, <laughs> yeah, it has a 3D version. Yeah. Oh. Okay. You watch the normal, right? Yeah. You watch normal. 3D? I watch tri normal. Normal. <laughs> <laughs> so for me, the uh, character of Pai is more to um, suitable to make uh, idols because he has a brave, he, brave person can handle a tiger. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It yeah. shows so about it's understanding true. between a yeah, human and animal. Yeah. How do yeah. we use animals yeah. people can interact with human differently? I guess it's all about control here. Yeah. Yeah. Not to take over him but try to is it possible to talk with the tiger? I think it's, 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 possible. Possible. it's possible. It's possible. It's possible. Have you ever watched Kong? Kong, yeah. Kong, yeah. 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 <laughs> that represents control. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. What about you guys? Because the relationship with tiger to fish animal and the animal is 227 days with tiger. So, What's your opinion? What's your review? I think uh, it's the same like that uh, because uh, it's 
buying is very brave ah. Yeah. Cuz is control uh, animal like a tiger. It's very impossible animal to control it. So one can one seven day. One hundred twenty seven days. Twenty seven. It's very impossible. Yeah, I think it's quite it's amazing. Okay. And then even the island, like what Kimi said, the graphics were nice. Yeah. Yeah. And I believe it, it it really it really showed through the island because at night it was glowing with all the water. I believe the, the yeah, the, and the glowing in the, the water. Bill. I believe it's like bioflagellates. Uh, yeah, it's a form of <coughs> microbe that goes uh, inside the ocean at night, which is quite interesting. And you can see that they've done their research on some scientific uh, facts in this movie as well. So it's not, a, it's not only philosophy, but it's also a bit of science fiction maybe. But I saw some movie reviews that say uh, actually actually Richard Parker is another side of Pi. Because Richard Parker symbolizes the greedy, the, the desire of Pi, but Pi is a, a very kind person. So which one takes over which one first? And finally they uh, both of them are balanced to each other. So there's there's nothing like the tiger wants to kill Pi or the Pi wants to kill the Richard Parker. But in the end, the tiger... Go away. Uh, yes. It's so sad. Yeah, it's so sad. <laughs> he, was, he didn't even look back, right? Yeah, yeah. Oh, he didn't oh my god. Back. I was like, oh my god. Mm. And so, how much you guys rate for this movie? Out of 10? Out of 10. Movie, I rate 8.5. 8.5. Yeah, because of the graphic and the storyline led sense. You? To me, 7.5. So. I thought you were going to say 2. <laughs> 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 right, I don't. Because it's very. What do you mean? I'll skip that part. Very. This movie is. It's graphic and a lot of, plot of stories. So. For me, nah, this movie is not cliche. The same with uh, another movie. This, the story is about human and animal. Only. Within 227. Plus, yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah, I think I would agree with Kimi that I would give a 9 over 10 as well. Because. Yeah, because of the interaction between a human and an animal, like not a lot of movies would make that. And plus the graphics and how actually uh, they actually built a tank yeah. for the movie itself in Taiwan. Oh. Uh, yeah, just to make all these special effects. So yeah. I think they put a lot of effort and they deserve it. Yeah. I think I would give it a 7.5 because I like, I like this general kind of movie because it's kind of rare for interaction between an animal with, uh, with human and they cause no harm to each other. So it's kind of uh, if it's needs me actually. So Jinka? Mm, I will give 9.5 out of 10. Wow. Because, I, because I really learned many things in this movie and yeah. some of the scene I still haven't understand it. So no. okay, I maintain a 0. 0.5. The is, did you cry? <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> Uh, so me for my rating is just uh, seven point five over ten, and might be I I don't understand the video. My I want to watch the movie again. But well, uh, in conclusion, the movie is amazing. Graphics is amazing. The story, all things are new to me. Not just like cliche or same. Typical usual, usual, usual way. Yeah, typical usual way in presenting a movie. And for me, this is great, amazing. Yeah. Yeah. But okay, I, have, I have an interesting question for you guys. Uh-huh. Yeah. What if you were Pi and you would have an animal out in the sea with you? Uh-huh, uh-huh. What animal would it be? Oh my god. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> that would be amazing. And can you imagine how would you interact with it? How you behave, how they behave. Sita? 
now this yeah. imagine no, it's it's imagination you to interact with human also so hard true, you know, true. Yeah. what do you want to interact with i think better we can interact with animals yeah, compared yeah. to humans so now yeah. yes. even if it would eat you uh, it's you <laughs> i think i can control and we we'll yeah. not have any miscommunications there's not not such things happen uh, if yes. animal so i didn't tiger what animal is he mm. Okay. Cat, 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 yeah. Well, we can learn so much of uh, living things in the ocean. Yeah. So some part, so what? Flying fishes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yes. Fishes. Yeah, I've never been seen. <laughs> flying fishes. See, they're not flying. They're just <laughs> jumping. Jumping. No, jumping. Jumping. Yeah, it's a bit high. Physics. Uh, uh, concept. Parabolic. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, we back to the questions. What animal will you like? Oh yes, <laughs> that is an interesting question. Yes. Max. What animal? What animal? Do you choose to stay with it? Ding, horse. 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 Oh, oh. oh. yeah, the yeah, boat would like sink. sink. <laughs> yeah. 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 And you also cannot ride on a boat. Wait, can horses swim? Can. Yes, can. 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 Oh, yes, oh, interesting. No, so you can ride on it and then it can swim. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, other than the horse? I think I go for dog. 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 Oh my god, dog. a dog would be okay. Because dogs are human's companion. Yeah. Yes, yeah. the best yeah. companion. Yeah. For, for me, I, I just choose the dog. Okay. You can swim also, right? Yeah. 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 <laughs> Strong but how long do you want to swim? You have to stay in the wood, you need to see someone to help you. Yeah, true. Yeah. For me, I prefer him still. Hamster! Hamster is small! Easy to handle. Easy to handle. Yeah. <laughs> no need to feed also can, right? Yeah. No need to think about it, just let it, just let it, let it run in the wheel. Then in the wheel, give him food, give him water. Uh, yeah. That's all. What about you? Nisa, I think for me, I would get... I, I'm not sure, but not, not too big, not too small. I mean, I would prefer a dog or a cat, but that's not fine, right? It won't eat us. It's, it's just there to accompany yeah. us. So, maybe a meerkat? Yeah. Right? I mean, it was on the island, so yeah. I might as well, like, hey, jump in, you know? <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Amira? I think I would, I would like to bring along a monkey. Monkey, oh my Because God. I have one of my security guards in my housing area, oh. which I have a pet monkey, and the monkey always follows him everywhere, and always, you know, if he, uh, he's in danger, the monkey will protect him, and so on. And if it's it's me, usually because it looks like a monkey can interact well with humans too. Ooh. Yeah, so many types of the monkey. So which monkey are you prefer? <laughs> <laughs> You. <laughs> Me. Yeah. Oh, but I scared monkey. Okay. Oh my god, monkeys. Panzi, orang tan. The normal monkey, I think. The other monkey that you can see in the jungle. <laughs> but the orang tan was actually originally in the boat, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Sampai. Yeah. Hyena, yeah. 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 will fight yeah. the Hyena, yeah. Okay, so they don't matter, right? It's me. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's cute. Oh, interesting. For me, I think I will choose dog. Although I don't even have a dog. <laughs> because dog is the best companion for humans. So that's why I choose dog. Hmm. Uh, for me, also dog. Dog. Right? dog. dog. <laughs> dog. <laughs> okay, it should be different type of dogs, right? Oh my god. Uh -huh. What breed do you prefer? Um, so I don't know about um. dog actually, but uh, no more dog. We have canine, we have chihuahua, we have... No, no, chihuahua, chihuahua is so noisy, oh my god. Chihuahua is so small, it doesn't even have like fur on it. But it's very noisy. Yeah. Okay. It's quite small, that's why. It's very big eyes. High maintenance dog. High maintenance. Yeah. Poodle, 
Pudi yeah. is high maintenance dog, right? Yeah. What dog? I also don't know. <laughs> but it's dog, ah. Bulldog. 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 Every dog, uh, every dog is suitable except the Chihuahua. <laughs> <laughs> and Husky, yeah, Husky, Husky is so stupid. Husky is so stupid. Husky is so stupid. Noisy. Seems like wood. Yeah. But it's a bit stupid. It can be a teddy bear at night. Oh, teddy bear. Very big. Teddy. No, teddy is kind of small. <laughs> so, uh, back to the movie. Teddy bear. We're going to way too far. Uh, what if... What, I mean, what do you think about... You know how... Um, Pai, <coughs> who is in Maltar, is in three different religions. Oh, yeah. yeah. Right? So, would you agree on that? Mm. Uh, personally, I think I, I would disagree because to have three religions at once, it's like some, it's like you can't decide which uh, way you which way you would like to follow. Uh. So by following all three, it seems like you're in confusion yeah. and that would set something else to yourself because you don't know who you are and who to yes. follow, which concept yeah. to follow in all of this. Yeah. How about you guys? I think I also cannot accept this but because I I scared there is a conflict between these three if I, if I have many religions then I have conflict about mm, Maybe this uh, religion says can, but the other one says cannot. cannot. So which, so which should I choose? Right, this is a conflict. Uh, okay, for me, you? there is always be a truth. In based on three this religion, there will be some truth. For me, I'm not following, but I respect. Respect, yeah. yes. Yeah. Respect is a very important. Yeah. Uh, for me, I just respect one, one of the religion. Eh, respect <laughs> all of the religion and follow one of the. Yeah. Yeah, well, the religions. Mm. Even you no need to follow. You just understand. Uh, understand why. Now that they are not understanding. Yeah, just. It's too much conflict. Yeah. yeah. Uh, <coughs> <would> we <coughs> like to conclude. Yeah. Okay, all of us really enjoy this movie. Yeah. Yes. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> and any more to say? No, Anyone? Say any more. Okay, so um, to conclude it up, um, it is a very good uh, philosophy movie, yep. and in the movie you can see how the human, yes, interacts with the animal, we see it a lot of times, and it's just interaction, also how um, one with the one who can control his mind and one who can't mm. actually uh, respects each other in different ways and how they tolerate with one another because they are in a very uh, basic need for them to survive so we can see how important it is for us ourselves yeah we need to control we emotions we need to control emotions or control towards yes animals and also other humans yeah yes so uh, thank you so much for coming this time yeah so uh, i'll see you guys next time then. yeah all right okay. bye. thank you bye 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 to the camera bye, bye. <coughs> director cut time do your thing okay One. yeah